on today in Florida controversy for the Florida Panthers head coach. The coach accused of looking the other way when an alleged sex assault happened more than a decade ago. Sims Rafael Pierce has the details from FLA Live Arena in Sunrise. And I buried this for 10 years, 11 years. A hockey player being praised for his courage. Kyle Beach speaking out, alleging a former assistant coach sexually assaulted him back in 2010. And it's destroyed me from the inside out. The emotional interview airing on Canadian TV Wednesday night. I felt sick to my stomach. I reported this and I was made aware that it made it all the way up the chain of command. That chain of command, according to Beach, includes Florida Panthers head coach Joel Quenville, who back in 2010 was the head coach of the Chicago Blackhawks. Beach accusing the 62-year-old of looking the other way. I, was, I witnessed meetings right after I reported it to James Gary that were held in Joel Quenville's office. The Blackhawks were fined $2 million this week after an investigation revealed the team mishandled the sex assault allegations. The team's general manager has resigned. Quenville behind the Panthers bench for Wednesday night's game after Beach's interview aired. He announced he will meet today with the NHL commissioner. Uh, I won't comment any further to the appropriate time after I, I meet with the commissioner. The coach, a no-show for questions after the game, but in an unusual move, the team's general manager making a public statement. There's no question that the events described in yesterday's report are serious and severe. Back in July, Quenville called the allegations, quote, clearly serious and says he learned about them just last summer. Kyle Beach says that wasn't true. Playoffs and the Stanley Cup playoffs, and trying to win a Stanley Cup was more important than sexual assault. While he says going public after 11 years will hopefully prevent this from happening again. I want to make sure in any way possible that this does not happen to somebody else. And again, the head coach of the Panthers expected to meet with the NHL commissioner later this afternoon. Reporting in Sunrise, I'm Rafael Puris, today in Florida.